And now my audio is muted. I am having the best time of my life. <laughs> the best time of my life. Give <laughs> my golly. I did not just break mods. I break everything known to man. My own controller settings somehow. And then my OBS. God. Why am I always like this? Okay. No way. It disconnected again. It disconnected again. Watch. Okay, controller. I'm going to bring you the, to the chop shop if I have to. Come on. We're going to turn on blue and tooth. Now I gotta switch the settings here. There we go. All right. God. We took a while going down the slide. I like to stop and smell the anemones. And old fires. Well, try sliding quickly instead. If you make it under the allotted time, you'll earn a reward. If you can make it under 315, you will be a rewarded token for both the time challenge and the macho time challenge. Oh! I see. Okay, well, that, that makes way more sense now. <laughs> All those times you told me not to skip the audio, uh, dialogue, I was like, Oh, okay, I won't. Next video. Oh, I, I skipped the dialogue, sorry. I almost pressed B to <laughs> quit the dialogue box. But I was like, no. Resist the temptation to reset. <laughs> I totally forgot um, the ultimate routes for everything. One thing, I, I, I mean, okay, I'm almost dead. This is not good. The one thing I'm afraid about is uh, Rock Slide, because I know Rock Slide is going to be torturous. Because Rock Slide is my least favorite stage of all time. We know this from that six hour long video for 100% of Encore. I think it is six hours actually. God, that whole video. Just me endlessly trying to get the best time and failing miserably. I like looking at chat. <laughs> I do. For some reason, I do this where I'm like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna look over here as I'm in a section where I need to dodge things. It's fine. 
I am pro gamer. <laughs> I totally was not looking at chat for a second. I'm like, I'm fine. I should be fine in this section. And then I notice I look back at my screen and I notice I'm almost going off the edge. Remember, kids, don't look at chat while driving. That's basically the same thing as don't text and drive. That's how bad it is. The first time challenges are the only conversations you aren't allowed to skip. Oh, it's been extended by 20 seconds? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. I've got a real challenge. Whoa, three-legged race. Spelling shuffleboard backwards? <laughs> no, rings will appear along this slide. You have a limited time to get through each ring. I'll reward you if you get through every ring. Get yeah, through every ring, yes. So 20 section uh 20 seconds for rock slide if that's what we're talking about is actually huge huge because that like allows um windows of mistakes if there is any mistakes happening like that gives us some room time for any improvements i absolutely hated rock slide that was awful I remember you telling me how the developers might have had to do like speedrun strats for the Macho Time. And I'm like, my god, can they just have done the stage normally? Because <laughs> that was awful, but I think we had to, um. I think we just had to follow all the bounce pads, and then from there we just try taking the best uh, short routes. I mean, shortcuts. I think. It's been a long time. Two years since we've done that, but yeah. Oh well. Ring challenge won't be so bad. I personally don't like ring challenges. But they're okay. However, in um, in Second Strike, ring challenges were awful because you know the circles actually had collision, and that made Cruise Bubble difficult to use. Where am I going? Okay, this way. Very challenging. Oh, I see. Yeah, I can tell it's very challenging. Like, if I didn't look up a video on how to do some of those strats, I probably would have just never completed Rock Slide. Oh, that, that reminds me. I... For some reason, I'm like, okay, talking about rock slide and skipping stuff. I remember you telling me not to skip the 100% cutscene. So I'll make sure not to do that whenever you get to it. I don't know if we're going to get to it today, but we'll see. 
We might get, make very good progress and get it all done in one day, but we'll see. No, thank you. I am done. Growing the fruit electric. Okay. Bobo blowing baby hunt. Not the hundred percent. The story cutscene after Neptune. Ah, oh, okay, I see. Let me buy those. You know what? I'll buy health upgrades. Why not? I, I usually don't buy health upgrades, but, you know, since we have extra points, might as well. Oh crap, I accidentally... Oh well. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, Encore was a bit difficult, wasn't it? Okay. Don't die, Austin. Uh, we only have one Krabby Patty. This is what we're gonna do. I grab this, and this part's gonna suck. But uh, we'll try it. No, <laughs> you kidding me? It broke last second before hitting the button. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> uh, of course, and that's stuck between electricity. Ah, I see. Yeah, I just... I think I just hate this challenge overall, even though you did nothing to it. <laughs> Can't do anything to it. Oh god! Please! Give me time! Give me time! No! Not again! Uh, great. Okay, speed run. There we go. Oof. Oof. Oh god. I almost went off the edge. Oh, right. I forgot to enable my extras. Oh, we got a lot of extras actually unlocked here. Let's take a look. It started out easy. Patty was this audio fine for everybody? So it's too quiet. I guess they call it a chump. I get laugh. Hmm. Hey, there's Squidward! Lots of toys to play with. 
Pirate Patrick. Eh, I also need audio is perfect. Good, 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 good. I don't remember a Pirate Patrick's uh, costume. Is that just me? I don't remember that. Is that new? That probably isn't new, but I don't remember it whatsoever. Alongside Jimmy. Oh, it was added by TL. Honestly, I actually want to reset or refresh this uh, section just to see this. I want to see this costume. Pirate Patrick. Dang! Wait, that is. <laughs> I think that's Disco Patrick, isn't that? Fire <laughs> Patrick. Maybe it's because I have, um. Chimney Sweeper? Eh. Oh, great. Oh, yeah. I have to switch. Oh, I didn't have the costume equipped in. I was like... <laughs> I was like, why didn't Spongebob change? Everyone's favorite May game is just... Cruise Bubble going for ring challenges. I'm glad I can see the ring in front of me. In Second Strike, that was awful because I always was like trying to figure out where to go after words. So much trauma from Second Strike, you cannot believe it. What was what was I thinking? I was like, Encore. The first mod I played on the channel I was like, okay, what's the second mod that we're gonna play? Ah, yes. Oh, oh, whoops. Ah, yes. Second Strike. Don't even play any other mods for BFBB. Don't even play BFBB. Uh, just to warm up. Second strike right away. I regret my decision making based on that choice. I now have PTSD. Everything that <laughs> I see in SpongeBob games just reminds me. <laughs> Of it. <laughs> the rings. The enemies. You cannot forget the PTSD I had. Especially Industrial Park. God, Industrial Park. Yeah. 
And there we go. Cool. Ah, I see. Okay. Wait, I already did memory depression? I don't remember that, but interesting. I don't remember doing I'm ready depression. Not at all. But maybe I did. I I remember doing Chocolate Creek. I did not remember doing the Sonic Wave challenge. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I see. So we can't have Karate Gear Bob. Oh no, it's just infinite loading. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> okay. Well, you know what that means. It already saved because we grabbed the last token, so. Boop! Where's Dolphin? Get the settings out of here. I'm done messing around. Get me back in the game. I think I waited like five minutes the last time I had an infant loading screen. And I was just like, well, that just means that the video is done. <laughs> I think that was the last part, I believe. Not entirely sure. In this challenge, you have to race against the clock. Oh, there we go. For once, I didn't take out the garbage for a month, and it had slides. You'll have to fly along if you want to beat this time. Do three laps in less than a set time, and I'll give you a reward. A minute 30? Three laps in a minute 30? Uh, okay. I see. There's gonna be some speed run strats that has to happen here. There's a truck. And we missed the truck. That would have been that good. If... Oh, it's just one lap in this mod. Oh, okay. I was like, a minute 30 just for free laps? My god. <laughs> We're going to have issues. <laughs> Speaking of which. Imagine doing a minute 30 for free laps. That That's like speedrunner territory. Not my territory, though. Get me out of here. Thank you. 
Even collecting the keys can be done with the lab. Really? Actually, that doesn't sh surprise me because the truck is available during lap one. So you technically could just backtrack and get everything. As you drive along the way, you have a limited time to drive through each ring. If you go through all the rings, I'll reward you. Ah, oh, I see. Imagine, like, um, being able to do, like, a curveball of, uh, oh god. A curveball where, basically, you, uh... Oh my god, I'm hitting all the oil. What was they saying? Oh yeah, imagine if you were able to do like a curveball where it's like, Oh yeah, rock slide, macho time, 8 minutes. Oh, why is it 8 minutes? Well, you get to the end, and then it teleports you back, and you have to do it all over again. <laughs> you gotta do two laps. If that had to happen... <laughs> Retirement's happening for me. <laughs> Movies ending up like, uh... The Creature from the Krusty Krab. No 100% for the video series. This is one lap as well. Nice. No! You've the <laughs> no! <laughs> Dang it! I, uh, gotta end the stream. Burn all the footage. We cannot have that happen in Encore. <laughs> Me. God, if Encore is like that, that would suck. Are you gonna play GTA San Andreas? Uh, I don't know. When will I? Maybe one day. I do own it. Yeah, maybe one day. Maybe I'll, one day I'll do a, a little one-off and then end it there. Very interesting, but you know. I have not heard somebody mention a GTA game before in the comments. Of course, this is a live stream, so. Oops! Oops! I am reading. I'm restarting. Wait, I didn't hit a checkpoint. So it just sent me back, and I. Didn't have to worry about time loss. Right? Is that how it works? I'm gonna have fun with Rock Slide, you know? <laughs> I hate Rock Slide. Rock Slide's like my least favorite stage of all time. Everyone knows this. And then, of course, I miss the extras in my least favorite stage of all time. <laughs> Perfect! And we did the same thing. Oh, he missed the bounce pad. I think it's fine, right?
Oh, I, I should have taken the left path. I, I lost so much time now. Yeah, that, I just wasted basically 30 seconds. Because I could have just taken that little right path there and boom. A huge time saver. Oh well. That's the wrong way? You can tell how long it's been since I played Rock Slide. Like doing the speedrun of it. I keep saying speedrun, but technically it's just the time attack. That was planned. Totally. I don't think we're gonna make it for macho time, but we could make it for regular time. We just wasted a lot of time doing stuff, but we should make it for regular time. Macho time is not gonna be possible though. We, we wasted so much. Too much. Like, that's the hugest time waster we made. Was back there, last 30 seconds. That one section, we fell off the map. That was like 15 seconds. And then we went backwards on one section. That was 5 seconds. Yeah, that was basically almost a minute. Of uh, time wasting. But don't worry. that That's the whole thing about games. Oh my god, I almost went off the map. Uh, that's the whole thing about games. You learn from your mistakes and you improve from it. I'm not gonna make it for regular time. That's not good. That is not good at all. We're not gonna have enough time. Oh god, we're not gonna have enough time. Yeah, that's... That's impossible. We don't have time for it. Alright. That just means restart. Dream's dead, boys. <laughs> the dream is dead. Me trying to get the time attack in one round? Yeah, that's not happening.
Never moan. Good time, man. I haven't said much because I'm like concentrating. Let's go, we did it, boys. We got it. We got it. There are harder challenges to describe. We won't have a chance to get those. Oh, we won't have a chance to get the extras during the ring challenge? Okay. TOS just got a big step towards being more modable. Proof for square? Oh, they're in the best time. Yeah, that's true. But true for square has become more monoble? Oh, that's nice. Nice, nice, nice. That is really good news to hear. I mean, technically it's just textures right now, but imagine the future. Like, the things you could do with, um, True for Square. That'd be cool. Like, I remember the one day uh, you released the soundtrack, um, replace, um, replacement type of mod. And I'm like, well, hopefully this game gets more uh, support for modding, because I know some people enjoy that game. And would like to see it being modded more. So that's good news. Really good. Hopefully one day we get to see 
like more capabilities of where it's like oh yeah you can now um have it where you can edit the levels and stuff or whatever industrial park stuff <laughs> simplest of terms I am not good at terms, so industrial park things. Ouch! I think that landing on those spikes made me go so much slower. Texture and, and, and only one file? Oh Huh. Interesting. Ah, I see. So I just got screwed over by spikes. Cool. You know, actually, speaking of which, I think uh, the wall, when I was doing the Macho Time, when I slid it right across that, like, little, um, little collision, I felt like I was slower than usual. Like, I feel, felt like that decreased my movement by a, a lot for a long time. Maybe it's just me, but... I don't know. I think I complained about that a lot when I was um, first doing Macho Time. And I am proud for myself for doing Macho Time in just a second try. Like, that's crazy. Like, younger me would have been like, how did you do that? Well, you just have to do three hours on this stage and re remember the strats. And technically, there's boxes and stuff that helps guide you uh, where to go, so... Yeah. <laughs> because I think uh, these shiny objects lead you to the worst route. Like, the boxes on the... Um, on the pathway that I was taking felt like the fastest way to go. While the shiny objects were the longest way to go. So that's what I just kept doing. I was like, avoid the boxes with the TNT, avoid the red shiny objects, just follow the path with the box, regular boxes, and we'd be good. And that was the right play to go. So I don't know if that was intended by the developers or you. I don't know if they were in the original, but yeah. And that is the ring challenge. You're gonna edit all of the music that plays in the level. But if you want to know your, and if you know your editing, video editing skills, you can edit. Oh, you can edit the movies. I mean the cutscenes. Can edit the menu or hub themes. Interesting. That's interesting. You can edit the cutscenes. Wait, what? But... 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 We, we, we did do the manly... Okay. <laughs> we did do the manly challenge, Mindy. What are you talking about? I swear I got 421 at the end there. When I heard she had challenges, I was like, oh boy. 
This is not good to hear. Oh well, at least we know strats. I absolutely beat it? Oh. What the heck, Mindy? You're not impressed by my rock slide pro skills? Maybe Mindy was like, man, us killer, you're you're so amazing at rock slide. I wanna see you do it again. I'm like, thank you, Mindy. I appreciate the compliments. But at the same time, I hate you. Why are you making me do it in this? It's okay. Not bad. Absolutely beat it, but it's fine. It's fine. We're just gonna beat it again. Nothing wrong uh, with our halfway, because we figured out the optimal route already, so as long as I just don't uh, hit spikes or ruin my momentum, we should be fine. I have hope in myself. reality if this was a video I probably be like dang it Mindy I don't know if we're gonna beat this I have hope You know, I have to change this live stream's title and everything. I totally forgot I named it. Having issues will change title later. <laughs> hey, what's your favorite movie video? Oh, the one that is titled Having Issues will change later. Ah, uh, yes. Such a classic. Your reward. Oh, I see. So it was never added. Well, see, look at that. I am helping you with testing on the mod. I like bringing out, you know. The last I like breaking mods. <laughs> Making developers think, man, this mod, I have an idea for a patch. Nothing wrong with the mod, though. <laughs> so, I'm not saying it's bad or anything. Please don't, please don't hate me. <laughs> like, I was, uh, I, um, um, uh, crap. Like, I am taking part in testing out Blacklight. Is it Blacklight? 
Or is it Blackout? I forgot the, the mod title now. But I'm taking a part of that ma uh, mod uh, testing. And, um... I was like, man, you know, I think I'll be a great tester. I break mods unintentionally. Remember the one time I kept opening new game mode uh, five times and then I tried loading a save and it crashed the game? Classic, iconic, oscular moment. Hey, that's that's totally fine that the thing wasn't added because I did get the optimal route, but it did help you learn of the issue, so it worked out in both ends. I learned my optimal route, and yeah, we're able to work together. Now I just need to learn how to use Industrial Park. Because... Um... The whole thing with, um... Uh, the, 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 what's it called? Uh... Fall mod. God, how did I space out on my own mod? <laughs> the thing with, um, fall mod... Of course... TLL is the co-creator. Heavily co-creator. Because he's basically created everything and i just been directing um, said changes. The reason for that is, is because I don't know how to use Industrial Park. And TLL sort of has been teaching me how to use Industrial Park while we create Fall Mod. Ow. Let's try this way. Maybe the extra is this way. Who knows? I gotta take this path. And... Um, yeah, so far what I learned from Industrial Park is, uh, placing objects, changing the skybox, and changing textures, and learning the files, like, I think HP01, I think that's right, is hub, JF is jellyfish fields, like, there's different types of file names that you have to know for using Industrial Park if you really want to get technical with it. So I'm learning things. It's just me and TLL haven't worked on Fall Mod for a while. At least I haven't really worked with him on it for a while. I'm not entirely sure if he's worked on it by himself recently or not. I know he's been working on other projects, so can't really blame him for not working on Fall Mod. So hopefully one day we are like, oh yeah, we'll continue it one day. There's even a, um, a little demo video that TLL sent me that I was like, man, this looks awesome. I cannot wait for you guys to see it. Do we miss the extra? I don't know if I, if I will show the demo video. Maybe one day. When we're closer to um, releasing Ball Mod, like having it like closer to completion, we'll just like have a little teaser of the with the demo video, and then all of a sudden we, um... We just release the demo video on the same time as... CRAP! 
<laughs> at the same time we release um the actual demo for fall mod i think that would be a good timing And of course, I'm going to play my own mod, even though technically I won't be, like, won't have the best reactions where it's like, Oh, wow, I totally did not know this was the thing. Whoa, look at this. I totally did not know this was added, even though I uh, basically helped create the mod. <laughs> no! Uh, it goes the other way. Oh, crap. Hold on, yes, sir. Panic. Okay, there. I forgot to turn these on. That makes sense. I was like, why is magnetic uh, pickup not working? Reason is, I didn't have any enabled. Good job, boss killer. Yeah, good job. Round of applause for him for not being able to. Sub correctly. Now we should be able to collect it. There we go. Alright, we're done. We're done with Rockslide. Get the stage out of my face. <laughs> Worst stage ever. Uh. Missing extra here? Hmm. We can't can't go there. So you're saying I missed this state uh challenge? Patrick gets steamed. I, I remember you saying that. I honestly am spacing on where this challenge could be. So I think it's somewhere around Hello? My, my camera? Be sure not to touch these or you'll get hurt. My, ca my camera's stuck. <laughs> um. Oh, it's... The cameras. Did that fix it? No, that that made it worse. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, what if warping fixes it? Nope, it still has it. What did you do before you worked at 3K? Uh, we grabbed the extra. In, uh, in Rock Slide, and then we just went back to the to, to the checkpoint, and then we warp to free K. Maybe we'll go to bubble blowing baby hunt, and I'll fix it. Just go to a whole different level. Unless we have an infinite loading screen, then that will not be suffice. That did not fix it. <laughs> I'll fix it. God, why am I so good at breaking mods? <laughs> why am I so good at breaking games? I swear to God. Okay. Uh. Help, 
We'll just reload the game. Okay, it brought me back to Rock Slide. So I'm guessing I didn't collect any of the extras because I didn't save. Cool. The last challenge. Well, that fixed it. But I have to get the extras again. That was so weird. That's the first time I've ever experienced that. That was weird. We have what? Dolphin free cam activated? That I don't believe so. I don't think so. I never used Dolphin free cam. That was so weird. It was like a somatic event. Wait. Do you think I did like a perfect like frame glitch? Because I think I uh went to um I think I uh paused the menu right as Hans was dropping me back um at the checkpoint. You think it just like Lock the camera because of Hans, and the game just could not register that. So it was like, oh yeah, you're still having Hans on you. I don't know if that's the case, but can be the most reasonable explanation. That's the only thought in my head, because never have I ever seen anyone do that. Nor have I ever done that myself until now. So interesting. Oh god, I was not looking, I was looking at chat. <laughs> Purple Foundation does frame perfect stuff all the time, which causes music to die. Wow. What a trooper. The... I need to learn tips from this person. I may be able to break stuff, uh, frame perfect stuff to break things. I need to learn from them. I do it unintentionally, but if I had the power to, imagine. My test demo is just me destroying Fall Mod. <laughs> Let me show you the power. Let me destroy my own mod that I created with uh, my co creator. Boom, frame perfect. Uh, music to die, frame perfect, uh, camera locks, frame perfect everything, boom, boom, boom. I would not actually do that. More likely, if I known that frame perfect thing was a thing, I would be like, well, that's one thing to avoid. I am avoiding that 100%. But just knowing um, that whole thing was possible, that's crazy. I call that a big oversight. Uh, THQ, please fix that in the next update for uh, TSSM. Your last update hasn't been... You haven't updated this game ever since... 2004 when you released it. Please update it. It needs a day one patch. Just like, um, 
just like rehydrated how there was just invisible boxes randomly along the the train in the hub world and there was some other issues for example the notorious sandy's lasso um change which everyone i mean everyone hated there was nobody that liked that change i even 100 percented uh rehydrated and i can tell you uh rehydrated was you know of course it's bfeb you know better graphics uh better fps technically on dolphin you can get 60 fps so it doesn't really matter about better fps but so better movement better stuff like that you know nothing bad with it Especially when the newer generation can be able to play BFBB and then be like, Oh, there's a whole modding community for BFBB. Maybe I should play the older one. That's like, for bringing attention to that, but... Uh... At the cave at the end. Please don't lock my camera. We didn't get attacked by Han, so it should be okay. Right? Don't infinitely load on me. Okay, yeah, we're good. Uh. Yes. All right. Take two. <laughs> Seems working fine. So it must have been Hans. That is weird. It's cool to see, but weird. It shouldn't be. Oh, I see the challenge. Okay. I didn't know you can instantly die by those things. I think it's just. I think it's just because steam, the steam was there. I was on an incline, and my knockback was not able to save me from it. Ah yes. There it is. I. How did I miss it? How do I miss this? This is the, the, you know, a game I played back in the, the day. It was more of a walking simulator, technically, but, uh, when I used to be obsessed with, uh, getting achievements for Xbox, this game had a commentary section, and this whole commentary section was, like, talking about, uh, when you do a collectible, there would be commentary about it. And there was a, a funny little tidbit about how the player actually looked up to find a collectible. And how nobody actually looks above them or behind them when presented a path. And I thought that was funny because that's totally true. When's the last time you ever looked up in the sky trying to find a collectible? Probably not in a very long time, I bet. Unless you're doing custom mods and it's like, look everywhere, look high and low, especially for Sock Expedition Extreme, <laughs> another mod that gives me PTSD about collectibles. <laughs> ah, yes, there's one sock left in Jellyfish Fields. Where could it be? So there's an extra down there. Um...
think there's extra over there on the side. Think. No, it's just a Krabby Patty. Slipping, slipping, slipping. Watch your step. Uh. So there's two extras we missed. So there's two more extras. Question is, where are they? is thinking maybe it's in is this like walking on ice? the arena ah I see I see that's all right okay well that's not it there is a freeze fruit too Must be in the previous sections here. Wait, 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 wait. This is multi section, right? This is like split into two sections, if I'm correct. Yeah, it's split into two sections. Okay, that makes sense. All right. Now we gotta destroy these. Perfect. There's extra. And I know where the next extra X is now. I was a bit confused there about... We're now on the tr right track. I know where this last extra is. Because I remember doing it a long time ago. That's cool. Because I got attacked right there, I wasn't able to jump <laughs> as well. Thank you. Appreciate that. Then this last extra here is the whole toasters. Which I remember from your notes, you told me that the toasters don't reset when it's dying or uh, when warping. So that's good to hear. That's a really nice uh, quality of life change. Is there three or four toasters? There might be three. Or it's four. 
It's one of the two. There's a toaster right there. Then there's a toaster at the beginning area. Cool. I I hit a box. I think this is like the one of the longest challenges ever. You know, I was always scared when doing this the first time because I was like, oh, there's a closed wall. Where am I supposed to go from there? <laughs> but in reality, it just moves down. Typical heavy iron trying to troll us. There's one extra there. I mean, one toaster there. One toaster in behind us. And there's probably one toaster at the end of this stage. Hello, Mario fan. Welcome to the stream. Okay, I am too far from that. It is going good. We are... Oh, wait, what? It's going good as I... <laughs> stumble into... A, uh... My death. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, you know, Koopa is here, and we finally are gonna complete this, I believe. In one whole stream. Thing is, uh, surprisingly, I found some bugs and glitches here and there. Because typical me, right? But one of the glitches, um,. Actually, Koopa is working on because her rock slide uh, in community mod, Koopa made it where you can earn both regular time and macho time in the same uh, lap if you got the macho time. Well, for some reason, it wasn't given to me in rock slide, so Koopa is fixing the files right now to have a update for that. Otherwise, yeah, uh, we experience a Hans camera break. I never, uh, I don't know how to describe it, but my camera was like 
stuck. It felt like I was in a MFV, but yeah. Today is my 20th birthday. Oh, nice. Happy birthday. Look at that. Good time and streaming for your birthday. You get to enjoy live commentary. Never before seen on this channel. Okay, where's the last toaster? There's the last toaster. Get out of here. Rock slide is fixed. Nice. Oh, they really want me to do this. Okay. Sweet. Got that. I am pro gamer. I'm getting all the stuff. Real? Now we're missing an extra in this area? Okay, you fix it on GC, you have to check Xbox. Okay. I never played the Xbox version, actually. I mean, there's probably differences between the GC and Xbox. I bet GC has, like, less performance compared to Xbox version, if I had to guess. But the G... But the GameCube is my childhood system, and I think the game is in the uh, infinite loading screen as we speak. Speaking of uh, GC, <laughs> speaking about GameCube, look at the infinite loading screen we have here. Epic gameplay. Mm, top 10 out of 10. This is what you guys came here to watch me live for. It's the infinite loading screens. All right, Dolphin. Let's do this again. No, I'm dumb! Ah! Dang it! I'm dumb! I just thought about it. Remember those extras we collected? Yeah, those don't... They used in save because... I forgot to save! I forgot to save! Right? So I probably have to go back for the toasters, I'm guessing. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. I guess it's gonna bring me back to... Okay, it's bringing me back to Shell City. And let me guess. <laughs> Ah, I gotta do it again. God, I... Ah! <laughs> Why? GameCube version has the worst optimization for us. 30 FPS in certain levels and the fastest paggy wagon. The fastest paggy wagon? Oh, interesting. Yeah, I would assume, uh, you know, GameCube would have the worst performance between, like, uh, PlayStation 2 has movie, right? It's just there's no modding capabilities for it. I think it's just currently Xbox and GC. Well, anyway, my, what I was going to say is, basically, I think PlayStation 2 and Xbox are more optimized. Um, compared to GameCube. Wait, what? 
Wait. You're joking with me, right? You can actually set them off as Patrick? Wait. I didn't know that. <laughs> I truly did not know the watermelon worked. I thought you had to use the... The... Um... Cruise missile for it. it is the most restrictive version for the PlayStation 2. Ah, interesting. Okay, so. Interesting. I wonder why. Hmm. Who knows? Very interesting. PlayStation 2 version. Never played the PlayStation 2 version, but I have played the PlayStation 2. Of course, with Burnout 3, you all can tell I played it. But, um, I also have played Sly Cooper. I enjoyed that a lot. I think I finished 1 and 2. And that's it. We I never got free, I don't think. Otherwise, I did get free. I just don't remember playing it whatsoever. And then, of course, there was God of War. I think I played God of War as well. I even played Resident Evil 4 when I was a kid. Probably not the best game to play as a kid, but, you know. It, it did bring me... Technically, Resident Evil 4 is my favorite. <laughs> because of it. I am saving. I'm not going through toasters again. The further, if you can, and throw a macho throw perfectly. Oh, that makes sense. Please don't do an infinite loading screen. Thank you. Okay. Now let's try finding this last extra. Keep your eyes open. There are three extras. Uh, I got the one on the pathways at the end there, where you had to jump along the paths. I think I got the one where it's on this bridge over here, because I did take it for a pathway. I think the only one we didn't get might be near the paths. I don't know if it's true if there's uh, extra down there, but you know how you get to the end and there's like these um, cliffs that you have to jump across to get to the end there. Is there an extra down on the road where you jump down? I think there is extra. I gotta stop looking at chat while I'm driving. I'll look at chat in a second. <laughs> I keep doing this to myself. I look for one second and I see myself going off the map. Epic gameplay. Well, you told everybody, Austin, you're not going to look at chat <laughs> until later. 
Wait, that brings you back here. Wait. Did I make a oopsie? I made a oopsie. I was like, uh, uh, I never took this right path before. I want to check out where it goes and... Oops. It took me back. <laughs> Listen, please. I'll have to. Uh, I'll definitely take a look after I get up this last extra. Oops. And not down here. Ah, it's right there. Cool. And that's the last extra, right? Yeah, okay. What is everyone saying? Ah, yes. Kim Possible with the Switch. I totally forgot. Yeah, um... Yeah, it worked well with 60 FPS, but then cutscenes just would break and it would keep crashing on the same cutscene. And also, some people suggested, oh, you should do 30 FPS to make it work. And I tried at 30 FPS and the game ran like garbage. <laughs> it ran like garbage. Like, it wasn't like, oh, tolerable as uh, VFBB or the movie 30 FPS. It was like running at 10 frames per second. And it was awful. Oh, that's actually a good point. I didn't make a oopsie. I made a loopsie. I, I see what you did there. <laughs> and okay, now it's time for Sunday driving. I did. I totally forgot what the time was. I'm sorry, Koopa. Don't hate me. I'm sorry, I skipped the dialogue. <laughs> uh, we'll take a right. And then we'll take a left. And there's extra. And I missed that nitro. Well, I guess it's like 2 minutes and 15 seconds for Macho, if I had to guess. And look at that. The ice cream didn't even roll down on me. I'm just so cool. Wait, this is two laps, isn't it? That would make sense if this was two laps, if I can get back on the road, please. I am not taking the water path. That is death itself. Thank you very much. Oh no, it's just one turn. Did we get Macho? I don't even know. Would you like another challenge? We love As you drive around the track, ring Okay, rings will appear. Okay, we did get it. I don't even know what the time was supposed to be. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe it was supposed to be a minute 40. Or something like that. It's gotta be close to two minutes or late one minute. 
Unless I just like have the one of the best times for Sunday driving. Oops. Ah, ice cream! It didn't go off on me the first time, but it wanted to take revenge for some reason. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh god, we're taking the wilder path. Oh no. Okay. Oh god. This is... If you're trying to do the time attack, never. I mean never take the water path unless you want to lose. This water path is a death trap. Look at that, Sunday driving? Easy peasy. You did it. Much of it was three minutes, normal was three minutes and three seconds. That's not what it said for you. Oh. The final challenge on this track. We are the fastest this. Weird. Okay. How recently? Uh I don't remember, actually. I think I... Probably a few weeks ago? Maybe? I, re I remember that I had to get... Uh... I didn't have a fresh rip of my movie, so I had to go back to my Wii, get a fresh rip from that. And then I had to re-download the mod because, you know, the old version was outdated. And I was like, well, what if there's new stuff in this? I, I don't want it to uh, mess up my whole game file. So I just like left the old version somewhere on my hard drive and was like, you know what? We're just going to leave the old version in here. Where am I going? I am so lost. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to make this all new. I think it was a few weeks ago. A few weeks ago, I think it was. Oh, sorry, I messed up this macho at the time, didn't I? <laughs> oh, look. It's Leroy. Hello, Leroy. I was not expecting you to be in the here in chat. Watching me play this game. Yeah, I mess up, Macho. Ah. <laughs> um, if everyone in chat doesn't know who Leroy is, just look up some of the videos like Paper Mario or uh, Fears of Fathom. Uh, th that's him in those videos. We also do with a friend of ours named Help. Bitch. Um. Wow, faster than expected. Here's your reward. Funnily enough, uh, yesterday's session for a thousand-year door 
for some reason the audio levels were messed up so i had to i have to individually edit every section clip for help and leroy just to increase their volume to make it more audible i don't know why obs does that like everything else seemed fine helps was okay like it just needed a little notches but leroy's I don't know what happened with Weird Larry's. His audio was like very quiet. It was like as if he was whispering. I I didn't listen to the Toad voice lines. So that's probably like perfect audio. If I increase it up a notch, that's gonna be ear rape for sure. But yeah. Ah, uh, uh, no, I missed it! <laughs> yeah. uh, 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 oh, that, that insta kills you? You've been part of the channel for long enough. You are now my uh, moderator. Later, right? Yeah, perfect total voice line. Like, you guys will be excited for this amazing voice acting from Leroy. Amazing voice acting. There's two parts. One part uh, was towed up. It was so long that Leroy had to get water. <laughs> he lost his voice for, for a bit. And the second one was very short, but still had the same impact as Toadette. I didn't miss a ring back there, did I? I guess we'll find out. Oops, wrong way. Forgot inverted controls for camera. There we go. Should be a smooth sailing from here. I guess practice makes perfect. You've <laughs> come to prove your own. Oh no. If not, we're gonna top. Well, don't worry. I'm sorry, Koopa, for destroying your mod. <laughs> Maybe it's my part? Maybe it's partly me? Maybe it's just my... My rip of, uh... TSM... Uh, TSSM just was a bad rip, and maybe it's causing some errors here and there for you. Otherwise, maybe... I, I don't know. I don't know.
Are we gonna make it? I don't know if we're gonna make it. We're not, we're not gonna make it because I messed up. I see. Yeah, maybe I, like, got an old version before you, like, fully updated it. Maybe. Okay. I gotta stop looking at chat. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I'm not usually this bad. I'm, I, I'm not. I, I'm pro gamer. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I need to figure out the optimal route for this again. I reset it. Oops. My cord's on the mic. There we go. Like, I think, um... Um... Yeah, I don't know what's the best route for this. Maybe you take the red... The, that's not right. There's always test and error with these things. If I was doing a video myself, I wouldn't... Uh... Get down. I wouldn't be as uh, bad at this. <laughs> I mean, I would be like, oh yeah, nothing wrong with uh, test and error. But of course, I'm streaming to people and it's like, Austin, you can't be doing errors right now. <laughs> you must entertain these people. Like, it, yes, sorry. That was intentional. I, I like this stage so much that I just intentionally wanted to restart. Wait! That put me up! That, 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 that put me closer to the lamps! I didn't even look! I, I was face palming myself because I, I thought I failed it and it w brought me back to the green. Nope, that brought me t closer to the lamps. We would have been good. Awesome. So it looks like all the only have one ring visible. All the driving levels only have one ring visible? Oh yeah. Yep. I see. How long it 
has it took me to try completing this stage. I think too long. Too long have I been trying to do this. We're gonna stay on the blue. Right? I don't think we're gonna make it. We are not gonna make it. No. Ah, uh, we're a few seconds behind. No! Ah! Get down the slide in less than uh. men. Two seconds behind, I bet. Two seconds. That's how brutal that was. Yeah, maybe this is the faster route. <laughs> yeah, I think the blue route was the longest. I don't know why I was trying to take the blue route. Now we actually got it. Now we're good. We're good. We're gonna complete this 100% right here, right now. Technically, it's saying it 100%, but you know what I mean. It's not going to be right here, right now, but we're going to complete 100% today. Thank you. You've come back here. No, we're done. We're done with this. Okay, now we can get onto the main section. No backtracking, we're going straight forward, we're getting everything, we're doing it here, we're doing it live, we're doing it now. Unless we got an infinite loading screen. Cool. Here we are, we got the, our power up. Uh, what is it? Ouch.
Oh, whoops. Marco boy, Patrick. I think we'll keep that on. Entry challenge. Okay. Oh god, there's two more. We might die. No! <laughs> I didn't even press A. So... Wait, what just happened? Oh, I spawned right here. You'll only add chimney, Bob, so that Barnacle Pat Boy Patrick is name only. I see. Dang. Rest in peace, Barnacle Boy Patrick. You will surely be missed. Well. Cool. I, I didn't even press A. Oh, we are so doomed. It's Jover. It's Jover. No, it's Jover. I am one tough fun. We're men. Okay. Let me just. There we go. <laughs> Clear. I can't dive. I am gonna... I'm already losing all my health. And I'm not even on the next section. Oh boy. Oh, we got two, but also we're... Oh, wow. Cool. See, you gotta have trust in me. I am a pro gamer. Oh, these guys are back. I am not gonna survive. I just... Do these still have a hitbox on them? They do. Okay, interesting. I honestly don't know why that has a hitbox, but I remember that from uh, playing uh, the 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 what's called. Oh god, I triggered all the enemies. This is not good. Get me out of here. Get me out of here! Ooh, yeah, that's actually a good idea, playing Sly Cooper again. It's been a while since I played it, so... Technically, I won't really be like, oh yeah, I know everything. Technically, Sly Cooper, in my opinion, is like one of the games. The first one. 
Um, it's technically like one of the games where it's Crash Bandicoot difficulty. I can't say technically because it it, it is Crash Bandicoot type of difficulty. It's just not really platforming, but. It is a platformer, but it's not like a where you go down a whole linear path. There's actual um, there's actual world that you can explore instead of just being at like a whole little stage. Uh, don't hurt me. Oh. Interesting. Maybe it was like a cut extra. As you... Yeah, that would make sense, actually. What am I doing here? Oh, wait. I was supposed to get the... Oh. <laughs> Run it back! <laughs> I see. So I'm supposed to do this. We're gonna grab this. Wait until it is there. Go. Okay. I destroyed it accidentally. My bad. The Ultimate Combat Arena Challenge. <laughs> ah, yes. I remember that from Encore. <laughs> I, Encore, I think, had a hundred jellyfish, though. If I remember. Or 50 of them. It was some large amount. But I remember you wanted to include, like, every type of uh, combat challenge into one, but because of uh, restrictions and all that type of stuff, you could not, if I remember correctly. Uh, da, da, da. Okay. My bad. I I don't know why I keep thinking this is BFBB controls. Oh, oh yeah, you ended up getting it made? Oh. Really? Is this going to be part of your encore? Encore? <laughs> Is it available as a standalone mod and an optional add on? Oh! Interesting. I need a SpongeBob for this. Ouch. I forgot where the extras were here.
Let me tell you. Wait, I was still on the wall? I thought I made it over. Oh. Okay, well, that's cool. Yes, the Vayret Combat Arena. One jellyfish. The ultimate boss. The ultimate life form. The current version of Encore will be available as Encore Legacy Edition. Hmm, okay. Wow, thanks, Mindy. It's like I totally didn't do that. Thanks for letting me know. I, I thought you were going to tell me. Oh, God. Why, why am I going backwards? What, what was that? What was that? Yeah, but when you told me you, you were going to tell me how you were going to plan for Encore, I thought you were going to tell me. Well, here's the thing. Remember how enemies have double health? Well, now it's going to be a uh, second strike type of difficulty. Remember those faster bosses you enjoyed in the original version? Well, they're going to be four times. And I did the same thing again in this row. And remember how you did a no-hit on bosses? Well, think again. <laughs> bosses one hit now. <laughs> It's a bad that I don't know what a slammer is. A am I in the wrong there? Sorry, we don't have a police uh, station for me to learn enemy names. <laughs> Maybe it's these guys? Slammers? I don't know. What would I call that guy? I think I call him Mole Man. He goes underground, comes out of it to shoot me. Mold man. Lingers, spitters. You take three hits? Cool. It's been a while, but let me show you the cool Easter egg. Every iron's best times. I want to see. Did I beat the best time somewhere here? Two forty-seven. I think I beat it. Two forty-three. Maybe. Two fifty-four. I definitely beat that, but of course it was one lap, so. Rock slide, free, free, free. I don't know who you were, heavy, heavy argument dev, but 
There is no way you beat him free, free, free. Hmm. Okay. I want to try. Well, I want to try redu uh, reduplicating the glitch side data uh, during Encore. If you don't know what glitch I'm talking about, I'm talking about the glitch where I basically went underneath the map at that section. So I just like was at the bounce challenge area. Sadly, that was during the time when recording uh, OBS crashed on me. And yeah. Who's opening their eyes first? You? You? No? Who's opening their eyes? You? You gonna open your eye? Open your eye! Come on, open it. Open it. In the end, greed is your enemy. Right. Greed is your enemy in the end. Well. <laughs> Fun fact, I have magnetic, uh, <laughs> magnetic uh, pickup, so this is going to not be fun for me, but you know what? I like challenging myself. I tell you break the puzzle mechanic of everything, but you know, why not? Well, it wasn't too bad there. We actually got through it all. Dang, this is going to be three hours, isn't it? Is this going to be a three hour thing? Maybe. Because I think we've been streaming for two hours so far. Maybe. I mean, we did have streaming issues, so technically it's like 2 hours and 15 minutes, I'd say. Uh, excuse you. Look, it's Indiana Jones! I didn't know you were in Spongebob. Hello there, welcome to the stream. Ow!
Time for the SpongeBob challenge. I think this is the last one. Well, of course it's the last one. Of course it is. All right, here we go. These don't hurt you. They just push you. Ah. Uh. Right there. I just gotta go across here. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Yellow, blue, and red. Yellow, blue, and red. Yellow, blue, and red. Oh. Wait. No. I gotta go back. Let me go back. No. The blocks at the end will move much slower. If you have the old one. Also, get on the part with the red manlies. Yep, you have old build. <laughs> Confirmation, we got old build. Oh wait, hold on. I gotta be on this one. Mm, I see, I see, I see. Red manly. So, with some of the glitches that happened, just old build re relevant, or is it just because I'm Amazing at breaking stuff. Like Hans. I think Hans was just frame perfect. No, <laughs> you. My guess is Hans, uh, that whole camera lock was just Hans, uh, per frame perfect. I mean, of course, there is, like, in BFV, you can do uh, disable Hans by manipulating him with a time warp, I mean, not time warp, a warp location. So I'm guessing Hans just has a little bit of glitchiness here and there. Technically, the glitch I found is not useful whatsoever. It's actually more annoying, but funny at the same time. But maybe one day, I'll become a speedrunner. I'll find all the optimal routes, and I'll be able to glitch here and there. No. Maybe one day. We can get through this fan. Yellow, red, blue. We're just gonna wait. Perfect. That's not good, not good, not good, not good, not good, not good. 
なわけなんですよ。I hate ball challenge. <laughs> I seriously do. I prefer the Patrick slides that you used to have. Um, was it an encore? It must have been an encore. That was fun. Except for, what was it, Patrick Slide 3? Where it had the collision issue with the slides, you know? I'm talking about custom slide. I think it was Slide 3 or 4, if there was a 4. Yeah, I think it, maybe I should re-download this version so we had the faster version. Did you use a guy for the final trial in Pikmin 1? I'm curious, or you figured it out on your own? Uh... May have used a guide. <laughs> may have used a guide for Pikmin 1. Uh, final trial. Because I was like, well, what am I going to do here? Because I thought there was like something I had to do. Lightens riddle. Only two of these buttons are safe. Hint, green is your f greed is your friend. Because I was like, you know what? We're at the final step. And I don't know how long it's going to take me. We have two free days left. Might as well... Is a guide and help me out. But that boss for Pikmin 1 was the absolute worst boss I have ever fought. Like, it was very tedious and hard to kill. Like, if we had all the time... Let's say, for example, it was unlimited time, right? It wouldn't have been as bad. Like... If we had all the time we had, I wouldn't have to worry about the boss, you know, refreshing itself to for the next day, so I would be still able to kill it. Oh, still hit. Okay. Cool. Yeah, that boss. Awful. Awful, awful. And then I learned, like, after two hours or three hours of recording, I was like, wait a second. I can just, uh... I can just uh, have a bunch of yellow Pikmin pick up bombs and just have him eat them all. And then, yeah. Big damage right there. Because IGN is like, Oh yeah, you're just gonna have to sacrifice one yellow Pikmin with a bomb and then have the rest of your Pikmin attack. And I've been doing that for so long that I, like, was not able to defeat him for the longest time. So I came up with my own strategy, and that's called No Mercy on Pikmin. Pikmin with bombs, you're going down. We got all the extras, right? There's one extra missing? Where? What? You can't still blast me? That- that- that's stupid! I killed you! Okay. 
So there's still one extra. Where? Okay, we got the one with the... We got one on the... On the... Sponge ball. We got one from the bowling ball. Uh, you know, you saying that, Koopa, just reminded me, I may have forgotten to check something. <laughs> um, totally didn't forget to, that, um, there is a whole section. Am I going the right way? No, I'm going the wrong way. I totally forgot there's a whole uh, section that I have to investigate with the wall. Let me through. Let me through. I <laughs> this happened yesterday too. When I was playing Thousand Year Door, I was about to spend one hundred over a hundred coins just to regen my um, health for the party and everything. And then Lyra was like, "Wait, can't you regen health in the bed?" And I was like, "You're right. <laughs> How could I forget that? And what is wrong with my wall jumping?" There we go. So it seems like I just have a issue with remembering stuff. Hello? Here we go. Except BFBB. So for some reason I remember everything from BFBB and I'm dead. Like, I remember every sock location, everything uh, in BFBB. Like, you can do a test on me. I remember everything. It's fine. I still got it. I really want those fifties. Even though technically I don't need them. I'm getting them. 50 manly points. Oh, uh, let me jump. Thank you. Epic music. <laughs> Epic upgrading music. All right. Now we can actually do this section without worries about extras. Ouch.
Wait, what? Oh no, you upgraded before this room. The game might crash now, like, ironically. The crash gods have decided to spare you. Oh my god. Wow. I'm just... I'm just that lucky. I don't know how I avoided that crash. That's that's crazy. <laughs> oh wait, I think that happened to you before. I think I I remember watching a live stream. Uh, you were doing. I forgot what you were playing. I think you were playing your own mod, and you were on this section, and it just crashed for you like mid halfway. I think I remember that now. That that is so interesting how I avoided it somehow. Okay. Here we go. Enough for the whole family. Oh, heck yeah, that's a good price. Whoop! Eek! Ah! Hold on, I forgot. Oh, whoops. I, I messed up. I'm messing up. The road won't block itself, will it? There we go. There we go. There we go. That took a few tries. Extra. Am I sure I know how to drive? Of course, Patrick. I am perfect at driving. What have you been doing this entire time, Kobilimera? Oil, hot sauce, oil. How many extras are in here? Two out of four? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I see one. I know where the last one is. Because, uh, what was it? It was a secret stage for some game. Anywho, uh, for BFBB. Anywho. And that should be all the extras. I think. Well, now we gotta do all the extra stuff, and then we will be able to do 100%. Well, it's a good thing that the game didn't lock soft locked itself. That is true, yeah. I tend to get soft locked a lot with loading, long loading screens and all that stuff. We are not ready for the boss fight. No. We gotta do all this stuff. We gotta do 100%. We are not skipping a single cutscene. 
Not a single one. If we skip a single one, my channel gets deleted. <laughs> uh, 230, okay. You know, uh, fun fact, guys. Remember that pull I made for the stream? Fun fact. It was rigged from the beginning. <laughs> okay, in all honesty, I did not think of it until later today. Because I was like, wait a second. If I were to do, um... Like, for example, movie mashup. I had a, I had a video already made for it. Or um, April Fool's Day. And I'm like, wait a second. I can't. I can't make a video on that. Because this video is special for April Fool's Day. So, yeah. Ah, you tested Rock Slide on Xbox. How, how did that go? Is Xbox version polished? Oh, yeah. Ah! What the heck kind of... wonder if... Listen. For April Fools, I didn't know what to do this year. I actually had a plan to do April Fools, but that idea got scrapped. So here's the thing: my first April Fools plan back uh, when I made a video that said I'm deleting YouTube, and it just was of a short of me deleting the app YouTube. Well. My original idea for that original April Fool's Day video was I told TLL and Koopa about it where I would start talking about how I would hype up this big huge mod I'm making and everything. And then in reality once I open Industrial Park I'm like this is too complicated. I'm done. And the video just ends with no ending or anything. It just cuts abruptly. And that's it. But for this April Fool's Day, uh, nothing really special, <laughs> to be honest. In all honesty, I think it would make a lot of people, it may, a lot of people are going to be happy because the original April Fool's joke, uh, probably would have gotten people mad. <laughs> But yeah. Oh. It's April Fools anyway. How am I spacing on when the April Fools is? I think it's after Easter, which is shocking. How Easter is super e early. 
and is in March. It's like, what? How is Easter in March? It's always been an April thing. I hit a pole, I guess. And I ho hit a oil slick right there, somehow. Alright guys, we are almost done with this. This probably would have been a two-parter uh, two if I was doing a video. If I had to guess. What's weirder is Easter next year falls on April 25th? April 25th? Oh my god! What is with Easter? It's either early or late! <laughs> and I'm not going to be home for Easter. What the heck? Would you like to try and beat your best time? Week? Best time? Wait, we got the macho done? Oh, we did get the macho done. Okay. Cool. We don't have to do macho time again. Okay, cool. Nice. Yeah, I, d I knew that. I was just bamboozling you guys. That's an early April Fool's joke. I totally did not know that I got macho done. Okay, it's been a long while since I've done this. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Um... I think I did a oopsie again. <laughs> okay, you're back to normal. <laughs> oh god, let's do it again! King Neptune, what is going on with you? <laughs> Crap. I almost got it. Let me go this way. Oh. 
Wait, what? Okay, there's some glitchiness going on here in this flavor. Okay. What did I do wrong? Jesus. Okay. There we go. Let me get out of that ring of death. Is it a ring? Am I crazy or is the ring is uh, glitching out? Are you gonna glitch out? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know you can skip that. Okay. Crap. Oh wait, you can hit them? Regularly? Oh. For some reason I had to, I thought you had the bowl. Why why did I think I you had the bowl? That makes things so much easier. That does not suffice. Another frame perfect glitch. Heck yeah. I'm I'm just good at these frame perfects. I don't want to tell this. Frame perfect 100%. Oh, it's back. Crap. Can't see where the end of this is until I'm over here. Okay, that's the end. Still at it again? Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, did I do just enable the frame perfect again? Oh, there we go. Bold.
I had it set to real boy energy. Yippee! Oh, I'm sorry for falsely freezing you, Krabs. And may I say, sir, you are a very oh, okay. lucky in your employ, such a brave, faithful, and heroic young lad. I think we should be fine, maybe. Second, everybody, there's something I need to say first. Mm. I just don't know how to put it. I think I know what it is. After going on your life changing journey, you now realize you don't want what you thought you wanted. What you really wanted has been behind you all along. Are you crazy? I was just gonna tell you to get Maya down. Manager, this is the greatest day of my life. <laughs> Take me by the hand and so end the most heroic tale ever told in Bikini Bottom. And as the sun sets over the island paradise above the waves, we must stop and wonder how long until the sequel depends on the box office. <laughs> and get some sun, you look awful pale. Awful pale? What do you mean, awfully pale? Memory of Stephen Stilberg. Five years still never forgotten. Nice. Looks pale. I'm not pale. You're pale. I've only been streaming for three hours. That's not pale hours. A hundred percent. Man, we did two frame perfect glitches in this uh, live stream. That's crazy. What's the schedule for videos? Um, so. April Fools. Well, of course, not April Fools, but because I had to do this live stream, I had to make uh, that one part for uh, the movie, which was uploaded yesterday early by a day because today was technically, you know, the live stream day, but that's when the video is going to be uploaded. So after this video, it's going to be the typical normal on um, every other day. So basically, um, after this live stream, there's going to be a video on the 27th. And then it continues from there. So 29th, the 1st, the 3rd, the 5th, the 7th, you know, continues from that, I believe. I think. Hold on. Let me just check on my tool here. Okay, no, 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 no. I lied. I have a video on the very first, the first, and the second. <laughs> and then from the the second, it goes fourth, sixth, eighth, tenth, and it continues from there. Oh, look at that. We 100%ed. Uh, community mod. Look at that. We're crazy. Thank you for the GGs. Yes. Uh, you know what's even funnier? I even have plans already for Halloween. Like seriously, I have plans for Halloween already. I got games selected and ready. I think we're gonna have another month of Halloween videos. 
Well, of course, that's going to be a couple months from now, but still, very something to look at. And also, before I get off uh, and 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 stream, um, yeah, Sly Cooper One is going to be fun. I can't wait to play that. I will have to figure out a good time to play it. But um, before I end stream, I want you all. I have a assignment for you. Yes, I'm like the teacher that says, the bell doesn't dismiss you, I dismiss you. <laughs> uh, but basically, I have a, uh, I have an objective for you guys. So, you know me, I have a lot of interesting moments in YouTube. I have many videos. I have some iconic moments, uh, even funny moments for some of you. Here's your objective. I would like you all to go into a video, your favorite video, and find your favorite moment. Put the timestamp of that video, and put the duration of the timestamp, and take me in it. Because, if you don't know, a certain anniversary is coming up for me. And we might do a special reaction to all the uh, clips that you guys take me in. So, if you want to see my reaction to a, a reaction of a, your favorite clip, go down in the comments below of the video where the clip is, put a timestamp of the clip, and I will make a huge uh, video where it's just basically composed of clips for me to react to for an uh, anniversary. And, uh, yeah. And this special video will be... Have two versions. One, it's gonna have a reaction... Uh, version where basically I react to it. And there's gonna be another version where it's just the mosh pit itself. No reaction. So you guys will have a choice to watch whichever. But, yeah. Uh, thank you everyone for watching. If you enjoyed this live stream, I can't say video because it's a live stream. It's live. Uh, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. With all that said, thank you everyone for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everyone!